As you've already mentioned, yes, it is chilly out and about, isn't it, as we've heard at Westminster. And if you're up early in the morning, around dawn, a ground frost is expected. Our first widely chilly night of the autumn. Temperatures in parts of Cumbria, Oxford, are expected to get close to freezing. And it's because the wind is coming down from the north. It's been a brisk wind bringing that Arctic air today into eastern areas. And still a few showers overnight tonight. These are the towns and cities earlier I showed you rural areas. So it will be quite surprising, I think, how chilly it'll be tomorrow morning. And if you are heading into London, indeed, through the weekend, it'll be a little cooler than average by day and certainly so by night, but large dry on balance. We do still have a few showers though for eastern England, the north and east of Scotland here. That breeze will continue to ease away. It's more likely that we'll see some patchy fog across Northern Ireland, so not quite as chilly here as last night. But some fine sunshine tomorrow, a bit of more cloud across Scotland, temperatures on a par with those of today, so feeling pleasant as the winds start to ease, particularly so near the North Sea coast. And then tomorrow night, because we're introducing more cloud tomorrow across Scotland and the north and a few showers, the way will be more cloud tomorrow night, so it won't be quite as chilly on Sunday morning. It means that we might have a bit more cloud on Sunday and also perhaps one or two more showers, northwestern parts of England and Wales, perhaps a few more back into East Anglia as well, and one or two for Scotland and Northern Ireland. But again, with the light winds, we might have some morning fog, but by a bit of the afternoon, into the mid to high teens. Then the high pressure does move in on Monday. So I think we'll pick up more of a fog problem as we go into the beginning of next week, even though there could be some around through the weekend as well. But again, just a bit more cloud around, a few showers. There is the outside chance for London of a shower on Monday, but I think on balance for most of us, the rain should stay away 